Hey guys, um, I just entered a short trade on the dollar Swiss. I grabbed the 1.0033 for the 2 p.m. expiry. Uh, if we come to the chart, I want to show you why. So, um, zoom out. Over the last little while, we've had a nice, a nice bull move up. And uh, much like the TF live trade I posted earlier today, um, we're finally getting a retest of that. And um, on the move that broke the that broke the um, the bull trends there from here down, we have a a, a perfect 78.6 retracement. Um, it literally spiked right up to the trend line, uh, kind of blew through a couple of resistance levels we had, which I didn't really expect to hold anyways. But we do have another resistance level right around here that, as you see, has held in the past and has held. If you look left, um, has held numerous times. So it held. That's where it was established. Let's extend that. You can see that it's held a couple of times, a couple of various locations. Um, four hour, it was a right mid demand zone on the four hour. So it's it's a good strong level for us to keep in mind. So um, if we pull our chart back up, so right as we get the hourly test of that trend line, we also get a quick spike up past to the 78.6. Um, you can see that here's my expiration. There's my my um, my uh, strike and I will uh, so that's that's why I entered um, currently sitting just around $95 profit um, it's uh, 20 contracts I have on so I am going to pause the video and update once we get a little bit more movement hey guys so um, we're getting some of those bears now you can see that this is getting pushed down nicely our 30 minute is looking great um, we've got some divergence on the 30 minute to to kind of carry us over and pull that momentum down. Um, 185, 195, we're kind of teetering in between 185 and 240, have been for the last couple of minutes. But um, yeah, just wanted to give a quick update. It seems like that level's holding really nice. Um, the momentum's kind of turning over here. So um, I'm just going to sit tight, sit pa stand pat for a little while. And I will uh, update you again once we get some movement and when I'm thinking about taking my profits and exiting out of this trade. All right, so we've started to get a beautiful rollover here. Um, currently up about 330 on this chart. And you can see that the bears are just pressing it down. Um, it's amazing to see. This is a 30-minute chart, right? I don't need a massive amount of movement in order to profit substantially. So this this move right here is almost $20 a contract already. So we're sitting at 335. Um, I'm gonna let it roll for a little bit longer um, to let the the Greeks kind of work in my favor, and I will probably be taking this off shortly. Um, I'm have confidence that I'll be able to, to pull it down more. I mean, look at the 30 minute chart. It's just beautiful, ready to roll over. You got everything lining up in your favor here. Um, I love that strike. I love that I paid for it. So it, it's really, it's not worth over trading and, and trying to find every single trade when you can just get the perfect entry on one trade and just, you know, let it, let these trades come to you. So, um, I'm going to pull this off in a little bit. I'm going to uh, pause it for now, and then I will, when I pull it off. All right, so we've gotten the bears we need and we want. Um, I am sitting at plus 410 right now, trying to kind of trickling around there. Um, I am just going to, I'm going to take these off. Um, I'm going to take profits here. Um, let's see. Yeah, I'm going to take profits off here. So I will um, I will post uh, the chart to the chat, and um, uh, if you have any questions, let me know. I'm going to take profit right there.